What's up gamers and today we are back with a brand new Chromebook tutorial. Today we're going to be showing you how to install Minecraft 1.17 on your Chromebook. Before we start today's video make sure to leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on those post notifications to get notified whenever I upload brand new videos to my channel. Another way of supporting me and my channel is you can buy my memberships. They're linked in the description below. As always you're going to have a little join button right next to the subscribe button and gain access to loads of monthly perks such as gifts, emojis, badges next to your name in live streams, and comments. You can also get a secret members only Discord and secret members only live streams. Speaking of Discord, I have a Discord server linked in the description below. As always, come join and can chat with me and the other Erwin Tech fans. Also, if you haven't heard already, I released brand new merch on my channel. We got hoodies, sweatshirts, t-shirts, phone cases, stickers, and much more. Go check it all out linked in the description below as always. Always. Anyways, I'm not going to waste any more of your guys' time. Let's just get straight into the video. Alrighty, guys. So before we start this tutorial, you'll need to go to these two websites, which are linked in the description below, as always. You will also need to have Linux mode enabled on your Chromebook. I will have a video linked in the description below, as always, on how to enable Linux mode on your Chromebook. So the first website you want to go to is this website. It'll be the Try Minecraft for Free website. Then what you want to do is scroll down to the bottom right here, select this Linux icon, then click download now. Once it downloads in the bottom right hand corner of your screen, click show in folder. After that, you want to double click on the file, then you want to click this blue install button right here, then click OK. Once it's done installing, you'll say app is available in your terminal. There may also be an icon in your launcher. Once it says that in the bottom right hand corner of your screen, then what you want to do is close out of your files app. Hit the menu key, go up and scroll down to your Linux apps. As you can see, the Minecraft launcher is right here, but wait, before we open it, we need to do one more thing. What we need to do is make you a free Minecraft account. So just close out of this, then go to the second website, like I just said, linked in the description below. And if you don't have a Microsoft account, just click sign up for free. Alrighty guys, so once you've finished making your Minecraft account, just hit the menu key again, go up and scroll down to your Linux apps. Go ahead and open the Minecraft launcher by clicking on it. Then what you want to do is click Microsoft Login. Then sign in with your email and your password you just created. Alrighty guys, so we have signed into our Microsoft account. As you can see, it is the latest release, the new 1.17. So once you've signed in, just go ahead and click play right here. Alrighty guys, as you can see, Minecraft 1.17 has loaded up on my Chromebook, so I'm just going to choose single player and create a new world. Alrighty guys, so Minecraft has launched up on my Chromebook, and now I can enjoy playing the new 1.17 Minecraft brand new on my Chromebook. And yeah guys, I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Now enjoy playing Minecraft on your Chromebook. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on those post notifications to get notified whenever I upload brand new videos to my channel. Another way of supporting me and my channel is you can buy my memberships. They're linked in the description below. As always, you're going to hit the little join button right next to the subscribe button and gain access to loads of monthly perks that I mentioned in the beginning of the video. Also, another perk to subscribing to my channel is you can comment down below, I subscribed, and I'll give you a shout out in my next video. So here are those people who commented down below, I subscribe, go subscribe to their channel, search them up on YouTube, and show them some support. That's all for now, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.